Hey everybody, this is something I feel very strongly about, so please listen to what I have to say. For those of you who don't know, Proposition 8 is an initiative measure on the 2008 California general election ballot which, if passed, would amend the California state constitution to remove the legal ability of same-sex couples to marry. A new section would be added, stating the words, only marriage between a man and a woman is valid or recognized in California. This measure is also known as the California Marriage Protection Act. Now, proponents of Prop 8 include many Republican senators and the Mormon Church. These people believe their personal affirmations on what marriage is should be applied to everyone, regardless of their personal affirmations or beliefs. This way of thinking that Prop 8 subscribes to, that a specific set of morals and beliefs held by some should be forcefully applied to all, is not only radically un-American, but is fundamentally dangerous to the values that America has founded herself upon throughout history the freedom to practice one's beliefs without another group's beliefs being forced upon them. Proposition 8, at its core, isn't about who can and can't marry or gain access to tax benefits, but about deep-rooted prejudices that divide our country. The proponents of Prop 8 are opponents of the equality, fairness, and freedom of roughly 10% of all American citizens. At a time when America's economy is arguably in one of the worst conditions it's ever experienced in history, at a time when important issues like war and health care are at the forefront of our minds, Americans supporting Prop 8 are actively working against the ability of this country to recover from the serious problems we're currently facing. So where do we go from here? Well, regardless of your support or opposition to gay marriage, I urge everyone to oppose the California Marriage Protection Act. The only thing Prop 8 protects is discrimination. Legalized prejudice will never have a place in Western society, let alone the United States of America. If California passes legislation that discriminates against the basic right of marriage for gay and lesbian citizens, who's to stop any other minority from being constitutionally discriminated against? It would basically be an open door for future, prejudiced, more radical constitutional amendments. Proposition 8 is not what California needs. Legalized prejudice and hate is not what America needs. The many opponents of Prop 8 are being heard, and California needs as many of these voices as possible to be heard. Let your support of basic civil rights be known and oppose Prop 8. Visit knowonprop8.org for more information.